here to help bridge that gap between Friday lunchtime and Monday morning breakfast. These volunteers are preparing for a fight. So we'll do seven on each side if you guys will come and follow me. The opponent is invisible, the one that hurts thousands of Utah families, food insecurity. Catholic Community Services brings its mobile food pantry to nine Weber County schools. This week, the stop is Heritage Elementary. What keeps us pushing is, is helping the kids and their families. About two dozen volunteers Happy Valentine's Day. fill each student's bag with at least 10 pounds of groceries. We have families that it's a, you, you have to make decisions. Are they going to pay bills? Are they going to pay for food? What are they going to do? And so it's a way that it helps them bridge that time in between with food. According to Utah Food Bank, one in five Utah children, some 20% are unsure where the next meal will come from. That's what inspires people like Darrell Annis to make sure these kids go home with the ingredients for healthy meals. Ogden has some of the highest needs of food insecurity in the state. If you're not our food pantry, we've got about 2,500 families that are coming monthly. This food is a lifeline that Principal Jim Muir believes provides nutrition and also leads to success in the classroom. If your basic needs are not met, it's really hard to focus on what your teacher is asking you to do. Next week, the volunteers and mobile pantry will stop at another school. You get way heavier. Are you ready? Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Doing what they can to win this battle against hunger. They do have a big impact in helping our kids. John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah.